How do you folks? Uh, it's Wednesday, 5.30 in the morning. I've decided I'm going to go back up to the Lake District. So this time, I think I'm going to go around Ullswater rather than Thirlmere. And hopefully, fingers crossed, we might see some aircraft. To be honest with you, I haven't really got a clue if you get as many aircraft going over Hull's water as you do film here, but if I have a blank, I have a blank. So we're just gonna go see what we see. Uh, hopefully get some good videos, and I'll pop them onto the video onto the channel later. So thanks again, and uh, I'll uh, keep my fingers crossed. Bye for now. car park situated at the Patterdale Hotel, the postcode is CA11ONN, uh, so you just park in there, it's £5 a day, and it's quite a big car park, so you'll be fine. That's where I'm going, up there, overlooking Hullswater. Uh, right, I'll just pop up the uh, map of the route. So you come out of the car park, turn right, then you turn right just after the school, go up to Side Farm, when you get to Side Farm Yard, go through the yard and turn left, and then you make your way all the way up to Silver Point. It takes around about 25 minutes. Just near Old's Water. Got my mate with me again, Biggs. Here he is. Just walking down towards the farm, then you turn left. And we go up there, which is called Silver Point, and that overlooks Old's Water and the Jets. I've not even been here before, but I'm pretty certain they go this way, straight through that uh, valley there. So, I'm not really sure, like I said, what to expect today, but hopefully we'll see something. The weather's not supposed to be great later, but it's clear at the moment, so it might be an early finish today. But... Look at this, absolutely stunning. I'll tell you what, it's on a par with uh, the Mac Loop for scenery around here. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Like I said, once you get through Side Farm, turn left and you get to this path. And you go through the path and then you just make your way up to Wolves Water. There you go folks, on the way up. There's actually the farm actually has a campsite. So if you want to bring a tent, you can uh, camp here and the aircraft go right over the top of you. So carry on bop here now. I think it's about another 20, 25 minutes walk up here. We'll get to Silver Point. I think that's where we go. You see the path there? This is Silver Point around here. So not far to go now, probably about 10 minutes. And hopefully, I'll see some aircraft. Well, I've got my spot, folks. So, overlooking Old Water, Silver Point, this is called. And this aircraft will come from that direction. As long as you don't go over film here, for film here first, they'll carry straight on and they'll come straight towards me and straight across the front of me all the way down there so cracking spot absolutely beautiful so i'm just hoping now we get some aircraft to uh make me day fingers crossed well no aircraft yet but look at this beautiful look at that not a bad job is it going up and down the lake, properly chilled out. Fantastic. And 
big is watching him. Got his eye on him. Well, still no aircraft, but we've got quite a few boats here to look at. I think I might uh, sack off the aircraft and uh, start doing a page all about boats. Come up here. That's all I've seen today up to now. Plenty of time left here, though. Now we've got the canoeists out. They come over from the other side of the lake. Well, I can hear something, folks, but I can't see anything. So I'm not really sure what it is. Sounds like it's over that ridge in front of me. It's not coming over here anyway. It's a shame. Sounds like an helicopter of some sort. Well, says a lot I got to th film here a couple of weeks ago. Just saw an F-15 in the Typhoon. So I thought I'd give Ull Ullswater a go because a couple went, like a couple of weeks ago, a couple of went uh, over Ullswater and missed out film here. What happens? 15 minutes ago, about half 11, two F-35s go <laughs> right through film here and <laughs> don't come over Ullswater. Just my luck. So that's really trouble with uh, the lakes. It's not like the loop. You get you get on the loop, chances are they're going to go right around the loop. Here, there's a few different entries to the lake, so it's a bit even more of a potluck. But never mind. We'll keep sitting here. <laughs> well, still no aircraft, <laughs> so got another boat for you. There he goes. Captain Pugwash. Good lad. Well, this would be nice, folks. Kind of patchy just north of the lakes. I'm not hopeful because I, I think they uh, either would enter here from the south. So, looks like it's going to go straight across. But, you know, you never know. Keep uh, hoping. <laughs> Fingers crossed. See you in a bit. Bye. Hey right, folks, it's getting exciting now. We've got a little sailing boat. We've got, um, I can't remember what they call them. Sup, is it? Supping, somebody's supping there. And they've got, got a bigger sailing boat. The excitement is... Uh, I don't, think, I don't think I can uh, hold back the excitement. <laughs> wonder what the next boat... Oh, hang on, we've got something else coming as well. What's this here? Can't see it, it's like so far away. I didn't think I'd be sat here boat, boat spotting when I came, but anything's better than nothing. <laughs> Now it's really hot enough. Look at this. Yes. Oh, lovely. Oh, we've got another one over there as well. And that didn't even give me a wave yet. Just been watching this Apache. It's about five miles away. He must be shattered. Watched him, he's been going that. He must have rode that about a mile. Who said we all was dead, eh? Hang on, I'll come back out the two in a minute. Let's have a look. Big is watching. He's watching. 
watching him. It's a pass. <laughs> it's about uh, it's three miles away. I just saw a dot in the sky. I'm I'm claiming it as a pass. <laughs> <sighs> Got to keep smiling. Getting a cracking selection of. Uh, Folks here, and they kept coming, but still no aircraft. How big is that bit? He's <coughs> got his twig. Not seen any aircraft, but my dog's happy. Aren't you, pal? <laughs> You're getting tangled up. Well, I don't think we're going to see anything today. I'm praying I'm wrong, but the only thing that's been through that I know of is F-35s that went over film, uh, film here. <coughs> and I've looked on the trackers, and there's absolutely nothing. So this is, sometimes this is what happens. All right, folks, we'll try again. Got C-130, got uh, United States Air Force, Hercules coming down but it's 16,000 feet and it's not really dropping so I don't know what that's doing, whether it's going to drop down or not, I'm going to keep my eye on that but I've also got this Typhoon here as well which is um, about, again, idle. so I'm clutching at straws a bit now it's two o'clock. Still had nothing through. I'm trying to be really patient. Look at this, folks. Blank ups and out. I've lost my chair as well. Snoring away. Hi folks, we might finally be seeing something, I don't know, we've got a typhoon coming over. Uh, no call signs, I'm not sure how many, it looks like that's coming straight over to the lakes. And we've also got an Augusta heli coming up, helicopter coming up, and that's making its way up here, so we might possibly get something that's going to break this blank. I was thinking about going. But I've seen these two, I might just hang on just for 15 20 minutes to see what happens. Get in there, finally. I see a pass. Thank God for that. Just on the way back. And there's an arc going over Windermere. So I'm not sure if it's going to come through here or not. So I'm just stay down here because I don't want to walk any further because I'll be behind these trees. It's coming up here in the next 
minute, I'd have thought. Can't hear anything though, it's a bit weird. It's gonna have a film, film here, here. Oh no. Something's coming. Don't know if we're gonna see it or not. Tremendous. I'm on my way back, which is a shame, but at least something come through. <laughs> well, second pass. I was thinking nothing's gonna come through. Well folks, on my way home. I was having a blank all day, all day long, I thought, oh no. And then got a an Apache came through and uh, an arc. So, got two passes in the end. Thanks for watching the video. I've come to a place I'd never been before. Uh, it's nice to come up here, the countryside's beautiful. I'm gonna come back again. I thought I was gonna have a bit of a mare. I thought I was gonna have a blank to be honest, but then I got a couple of nice passes. So thanks for watching the video, hope you enjoy it. And bye for now.